Hello guys, in this video I'll be showing you how to get started with the Pixie 2 camera. Specifically, I'll focus on object detection and tracking with the Pixie 2. So let's get started. Here's the box that the camera came in. Inside, there's the Pixie 2, along with a micro USB cable, a cable to connect to the Arduino, and mounting brackets and screws. To get started with the Pixie 2, go to this website. Here's the Pixie 2 wiki where you could install Piximon and such. So go to where it says install Piximon and choose which computer you're using. I'm using a Mac. And follow the instructions. You're going to want to download. And once you've downloaded it, there's going to be a purple dinosaur icon and just click on it and you'll open the program. Connect the Pixie 2 to a computer with a micro USB cable. You could open Piximon and now you should be seeing some footage. The Pixie 2 is extremely fast because it processes images at 60 frames per second. The quality is low as to not strain the processor. Now if we go to settings, as you can see there's lots of parameters we could change such as tuning, some expert settings, signature labels, camera, interface, and you see we have the Arduino. And also, if you have the pan tilt module, you can adjust servos. There's also Pixie Mom parameters, such as where you want things to be saved, and layers. Note when changing parameters, you must click Apply. You could also start and stop your Pixie 2 from running with this button. Now we'll be moving on to object detection and tracking. Our first object is a ping pong ball. In Piximon, you're going to want to place the object you want tracked in the center of the Piximon camera. Then go to action Set signature 1. Drag the mouse over the object. Right now the glare is triggering false objects, but we'll just have to ignore these. When the object is placed in the camera's field of vision, it detects it. And even with it bouncing, it still tracks it because it's sending data back to the computer extremely quickly. The S equals 1 means signature 1. Each object can be given a signature, and there are up to seven. To change the signature name, go to Settings, Signature Labels, Signature Label 1, and type the name. I'm going to name it White Ball. Afterward, click Apply. We just changed the label of the object to White Ball instead of S equals 1. This makes it easier to keep track of objects. For our second object, I added a yellow piece of paper. Complete the same steps as we did for the white ball, however, just set this to signature 2. The Pixie 2 is now successfully tracking the yellow piece of paper. I added in a second piece of yellow paper, and the Pixie 2 successfully tracks it. You could even go to settings and change the label of signature 2, just like we did for signature 1.
In this video, we cover just a few of the Pixie 2's main features. The camera also has line tracking features that I'll cover in later videos. As always, give this video a like and subscribe to Robotic Nation for more videos.